Hmm, where to start? That's right, I need to paint my house red. It's good that I have a special sponge here. These footprints look like bricks. I will have the coolest design. The girls will be jealous. There's still a bit left. And awesome. Check it out, how do you like it? My house is perfect, just like me. Ooh, I completely forgot to add color like this in my game. I will decorate my house with grass around the perimeter. Oh, wait, a round window? That's not my style. This is much better, square. And here, I'm going to fix everything with my super chainsaw. Just some more details. And my house is ready. Wow! Yeah, so cool. Huh, what's wrong with the roof? The color of the sea wave fits perfectly here, so let's use this chainsaw. Ugh, it's not easy, but I'm not done yet. Oh, just like this. And now, I can make a cool roof. Oh, that's another thing here. Such a bright color. Now beware. I've got more stickers here. Don't you think it's a cool idea? Yeah, I don't make any other ideas. Now, I'm gonna add a flashlight here. And a brick chimney on the roof. I present to your attention the dream house. Whoa, looks like Ken did his best. I need to come up with something too. First of all, I need an artist costume. <laughs> How do you look? Wonderful. Okay, what color should I choose? Hmm, this shade is better. Get to work. Fine. Now you need to paint the windows. I'll draw hearts on them. Something like this. Wonderful. I'm gonna paint roof with the same shade. But wow. it's gonna be with stripes. Oh, I like it so much. That's right. Now I need to change. Into the gardener's costume. Let the gorgeous ivy grow here. We need to water it though. ta -da! Aw, it's so nice. And look at these flowers. Ah, I've got a great fragrance now. It's so nice. Only the roof left. My profile will become the main feature of the decor. Oh no, I'm falling. Oops, I'm fine. It's okay. I didn't even get dirty. Oh, the house turned out to be so gorgeous. Is this a posh house? Don't make me laugh. Now I'll show you what this word means. The house must be black and fireproof to frighten enemies. Uh, you want to burn it or something? Hi! Whoa! That's wonderful! Do you agree? That's another thing. Where is my spell book? I'm not going to mess with everything myself. Summon zombies. To me, servant of darkness. Who called me? I'm coming, mistress. What do you want me to do, Miss Wednesday? Put on a protective helmet. You're going to decorate the cows. Thank you for the concern, madam. I didn't even need it. Okay, but some... Chandelier ears here. How do you like it, mistress? Hang the window here. Oh, to the left, you idiot. Like this? Super. I got you. Wonderful. You're good. You can eat a marmalade eye. Oh, thank you. I love them. Mmm, yum. Not bad, but it can be better. It's time to freshen up my house and add bats. Go ahead, decorate these walls. Wonderful. 
the final touch and my house is finished. Oh yeah, thank you thing, it's a good idea. This is the best house. This green grass is no good. I need to decorate the plot with my potion. Rotten earth with their trees and a cemetery with the grave of ancestors. What could be better? Wonderful. The final touch is a path decorated with candles. Now I'm happy. Are these real graves? Oh! Whoa. Hey, no trespassing. Uh, save me! Ken, you scared me. Oh, I didn't mean to. It's just skulls of Wednesday. I'm going to my house. Yeah, this guy is so funny. This decor is too creepy and gloomy. I'll think of something else. Oh, I know. Let there be sin here. Look. It's so soft and pleasant. And this is exactly what we need here. Hmm, I'm gonna eat some more. And some more. And now, wonderful. Okay, it's time to choose a tree. Not this one, not this one either. Ooh, palm trees are great. Whoa, cool. I'm like on the beach. The only thing's missing is a lounge here and suitable suit. How do you like it? Wow. Hmm, palm tree, will you treat me with a coconut? Thank you. What a divine fragrance. I love coconut milk. Yummy. Oh, I forgot about the fence. Pink suits me. Now, you can just relax. <laughs> I'm done and I'm so mesmerized by my yard. Whoa, that's wow. the design. I also want to decorate my yard. Where's my hammer? Let's go. It's so cool. What's that? What are you doing on my property? Ah! Everything is clear. It's not scary. <laughs> yeah, it's not scary at all. Hey, lamb, come here. This is your new friend, come on. Here you are. Come on, be friends. Ooh, the bush is completely overgrown. We need to trim it. It's good that I have a pruner. Great job. This one, I like even more. The only thing left is to put the fence. So the graves at Wednesdays don't bother me. Ha, ah, what is it? I can't get used to it. Oh, yeah, I did my best. Yay. Let's dance. Wednesday, come on. Looks like Quentin decided to start with painting. Hmm, it seems to be working out well. Good job, Quentin. Well, it's kind of fun to do it. Oh, Quentin, the paint got on your face, but he did not lose his head. On the contrary, it inspired him to bid a bit of rebellion. What about Mary? Yeah, if you paint with nail polish, then at best, you will finish in old age. Apparently, Mary also guessed this. Well, or she was inspired by Quentin, who has already finished painting. Mary has not only a competitive spirit, but also some idea. It looks like she decided to trim the house with a soft pink fabric. So original and very soft. It's like I'm on the cloud. It seems that Quentin decided to dilute the blue with droplets of white. Look at that. Ooh, he got a little carried away and kind of painted Mary. And Wednesday. Oh my. You do not joke with Wednesday. Quentin, save yourself. A creepy hand is chasing you. 
Fortunately, he was able to hide on the roof. A good reason to celebrate your salvation and the end of painting the house by hosting the multi do flag. It seems that Quentin is not very happy with the appearance of the house, but he has already come up with something. He paints white. Hmm, I wonder what will be next. Ooh, it's a soccer ball. Very original. Well done, Quentin. I wonder what Mary is up to with her discs. We'll find out now. Oh, yeah, she decorated the roof with them. It looks very unusual and stylish. Look out, Mary. Yeah, the roof is beautiful, but just very slippery. The only thing left is to install the heart. Ooh, it looks like Quentin also decided to decorate the roof. But decided to do it with stickers. What about the second window? Hmm, it looks like the basketball is missing something. Quentin has a solution already. A basketball hoop. It looks great and so sporty. But it's such more fun to play with a real ball. The best throw? Yeah, not the best. It seems that Wendy doesn't really like sports. I'm sure next time Quentin will think a thousand times before doing that. Wednesday also decided to take care of her house. Yeah, not the brightest color, but it's her style. And of course, where without bars on the windows, right? It seems that thing brought a sword. Look. I wonder why she needs it. Yeah, only Wednesday can have a roof decorated like that. She seems to have come up with another idea. Yes, a little creepy eyes won't hurt this house, right? Well, it seems that the appearance of all houses is ready. And this means that we're moving on and we'll take care of the yard. Wednesday decided to start with a spear and a bat ornament. Look. Well, it's beautiful in its own way. Well, where do we go without thing, right? The best helper ever. Where without plants, right? But you didn't think she would leave it just like that, did you? Of course not. Where without the creepy decorations in the form of eyes, right? So, why does she need a shovel and bones? Is she planting them? What? Oh, very intriguing. Is she watering them? I'm afraid to imagine what's gonna be next. Oh, dippity doppity doo. My hands are out of the ground? Well, we're without a mailbox in the form of a coffin, right? Yeah, Wednesday definitely has a style. Creepy, but stylish. Quentin decided to decorate his yard with a hockey stick. And a garland. Very sporty. Only lawn painting will make it this house even more sporty. Don't you understand? Now you'll see for yourself. Look, this is a real football marking. It seems that Quentin thinks that is not enough. He decided to install a gate. So it is necessary to try out his new yard. Quentin, come on, go! Go! Well done, Quentin! Congratulations! Oops, he tripped over something. It seems to be a small trash can. But with Quentin's resourcefulness, it can easily turn into a great mailbox in the form of a frog. Look! Mwah. Hmm, so what about Mary? Mary decided to start with a mailbox. But not everything is so simple. She will decorate it and make it in the form of a flamingo. How creative and beautiful. And where do we go without soft toys of Hoggy Woggy? A pink heart instead of a plant is so cute. 
A great addition will be a pink flagpole and pink hearts in a form of decoration. And you can lay a blanket on the lawn. Spend time on it with pleasure. Put some pillows on and get a rest. The only thing that can distract her from this perfection is Quentin's trainings. Oops. It looks like a conflict of neighbors is going to fire up. <laughs> Well, Wednesday does not care. She has her own atmosphere. It's convenient when you have a thing that brings you cocktails by itself. So it's time to finish the interior of the house. Whoa! You can't even be more creative there. Well, let's see what Wednesday's gonna do. Of course, she decided to paint everything dark black. It looks creepy, so it's just right for Wednesday. Now, a little decor in the form of bats, bones, and spiders. Look, Thing also has its own house. How cute. Uh, I mean, creepy. Wednesday decided to do furniture next. A table made of tires, decorated with an old lantern, skulls, and plants. And another table with an antique candlestick. Well, where without an atmospheric garland, right? Look at that. And spider web. Where the spider? Well, it's hard to imagine this place without a fortune-telling ball. She has an interesting way of communicating with relatives, right? Yeah, say hi from us too! What about Quentin? He also started with painting. Well, here, I'm not doubting that it's going to be brighter than Wednesday's place. Now, he decided to add stickers. As well as glue Legos on the wall. Look at that. Ooh, we're gonna figure out what he's gonna do next. A large Lego man? Ooh, so creative and cool holders from Lego. He made a hanger out of it. Holders for charging the headphones. It turned out very beautiful and very creative. But what to do with the rest of the details? They need to be filled in a frame with a Lego man. That's right. This is a great storage. Also, Quentin decided to add some Minecraft and hung the axes on the wall. Also, Quentin decided to add some Minecraft and hang the axes on the wall and place dynamite in the corner. That's right, an ottoman and consoles to play your favorite Minecraft won't hurt. Hmm, Quentin, don't you think it's getting a little dark? Fortunately, Quentin has a chandelier in a form of a skateboard. It looks just amazing. It's gonna fit in right well. Just look at this! More light and more creativeness wow. here! Well, how's Mary doing? It's time for her to decorate the house, too. Mary started by painting in pink, and I'm not really surprised by that. It's evident that Mary is super satisfied with her job. Well, of course. She's a little tired. But how about a little glamorous decor? The most glamorous decor I've ever seen. Fluffy carpet. Wonderful. But you can go further and make a fluffy mirror. 
such a house simply cannot do without a closet. Hmm, I like it so much, but something's missing. Hmm, interesting what? Right, posters with a unicorn will be a great decoration for the wall. Well, where without a mini stove? Garlands will be a great finishing touch. Wow. Look, Mary has already made some cookies to celebrate the end of the renovation. She decided to have a tea ceremony with her hoggy woggies. I think they won't be too upset if they get smaller portions. Now I'm going to take care of you, honey. Here, treat yourself. Mmm, so cute and so delicious. Well, everybody has decorated their own house. And we're moving on. Hmm, looks like Mary decided to make a house for her pet. Look what a toy she made. She's doing it by herself. I'm sure Kitty will be very happy. Well, or a unicorn. And it's going to be his favorite toy. But that's not all. Where can we go without a hinge sunbed? Apparently, Mary decided to make a beautiful curtain, too. Very beautiful. The kitty will be very pleased. Just look at this. Huh? Mary, what? Oh, I get it now. It's a rat. But that's not just a rat, it's Quentin's rat. I wonder how Quentin will decorate his pet's house. Well, we're without sports equipment, right, Quentin? I'm not sure that the rat will train punches, but that's fine. Favorite cups, balls… It seems that Quentin has forgotten who he's decorating the house for. A wheel… A crib in the form of a car. He still remembers that it's for his rat. But I'm sure if Quentin had been smaller, he would have been happy to live in such a small house too. But it seems that the rat is also delighted. Especially from this car crib. Look at this, ratty. You can even ride this crib. Yeah, yeah, I know. I know you love it. Oh. Uh. Uh, and how are things at Wednesdays? Well, Thing clearly wants his house decorated, too. And Wednesday starts with a portrait. Then she puts a bathtub, a crib, and a few varnishes. What a care. What else does a decent hand need? It's time to take a new house hand. Ooh, looks like this bed made an impression on it. And the crib was soft enough. How about an evening manicure? Mary decided to go out her patio in the evening and watch her favorite multi-do releases on the projector. And as you know, joint viewing always unites and can reconcile even such neighbors. Well, while our heroes are watching a multi do channel, we suggest you like this video, subscribe to the channel, and look at the unfortunate moments from the filming. I think I should start because I'm the prettiest. I don't understand what this is. A glass of water? Is this some kind of joke? Maybe I should take a closer look? I'm afraid that's not gonna help you. Girls, I think I guessed it. You need to take a tea bag and brew some tea. Here, I have this in my pocket. Sad to see you go. But here you are. A tea bag? I've never seen anything like that. Do poor people really use what? these? Well, let's see what happens. I think the water turned brown. It's worth a try. It doesn't taste too great. I don't like it. I'm never drinking poor people tea again. This was my first and last time. Disgusting. It leaves a terrible aftertaste. I gotta throw out this bag. Oh no, no don't do that. No. You can always use it one more time. This is ridiculous. I would never stoop to that level. I'm just really thrifty. 
Open up yours, Bella. Wow, there's a lot of soda here. I don't even know where to start. Either way, I'm gonna need a straw to drink it all. Mmm, cherry cola. It's so weird. Look at my tongue. Cool, right? Now I'm gonna try a different drink. This is like drinking a real rainbow. I'm in such a good mood now. I wonder what happened to my tongue. Oh my gosh. In my opinion, I think it looks really cool. Thank you, Emma. You know what? I gave it some thought and I've decided I really need to change up my image. I want to wear something more suitable. So I'll have the help of my personal stylist. Don't worry, Bella. We'll definitely pick something out right now. I'm gonna need a really bright outfit. Sparkles. Ugh, that's just no. trite. We'll find something more interesting. Actually, I think I'll take care of your hair. Oh my gosh, Bella, I love that. See, that's much better. I'm so happy I changed my look. Thanks, Kevin. Bye, girlfriend. Emma, it's just you. Open up yours. I don't understand why there's so many glasses here. What should I do with them? Hello, young lady. Allow me to serve you. These are my signature drinks. That's not fair. I should have gotten that. There must be some kind of mistake. Look how pretty it is. And it's shimmering. This is like a drink fountain. Wow. Yeah, something's definitely gone wrong here. Tell me one too, please. I'll even pay. Sorry, but the bottle's empty. Unfortunately, I can't help you. Oh, really? She's so poor, she won't even be able to appreciate your drinks. Don't jump to conclusions, Susie. I mean, I'm no foodie. But I still know a bit about food. Emma, you can't take the glass from the bottom. Oh no, I didn't think the pyramid would collapse so easy. Delicious, I really like this. You wanna try it too? Here, my treat, thanks. Oh, that smells incredible. I don't like it. Ladies, it's time for us to continue. I don't think we need to hurry. Gosh, this fish stinks so bad. I'm gonna suffocate. Does anyone really eat this? I wouldn't dare, but you'll definitely have to try it. How nice of you, Susie. No. No, sorry, but I can't. Waiter, come back, please. I need your help. Eat this fish. I think it's already rotten. But if you ask me to do it, of course I'm not gonna refuse. I want to do this the right way, but I also want to do this the fast way. Actually, I think that fish looks pretty good. I wouldn't mind trying it. You're doing a great job. Bravo. I knew you'd do great. Thank you. I have to admit that wasn't easy. You deserve a reward. You can go now. Really smart, Bella. Well done. Let's see how you do. Cutlery and sauces? What does this mean? Here you are, your fish steak is ready. Thank you. This looks so tasty. I'm definitely gonna need this silverware. It's time to try this divine dish. It's pretty easy to cut. The cook did a really good job. The fish is so tender. That's what I call top cuisine. Oh, this taste blows me away. I'm sorry, but I can't hold back. I wanna eat this all now. Oh, I almost forgot about the sauce. That's just great. I didn't expect this from her. Susie, you're kind of scaring me. I just really like to eat. Well, if you'll excuse me, I'll take away the dirty dishes. I'm at a loss for words. Emma, open up your dish. It's hard to call this a dish. There's an aquarium here. What should I do with it? I don't want to eat live fish. You'll have to. Those are the rules. I have a better idea. You don't need to know about it. All right, I'll eat this fish right here if you insist. Oh my gosh. I'm too scared to look. Poor little fish. It didn't deserve this. Finally, they're not looking. Come here, I'll save you. This is great. I'll hide you. Let them think I just ate you. Look, she really did it. 
That was delicious. <sighs> you murderer. I don't understand, where's our food? I can't believe they're making us wait so long. Oh, hello, who are you? Uh, if you don't mind, Bella, I just want to say I really like wow. you. Will you go out with me and accept this ring? Oh, this is really unexpected. I don't even know what to say. Wow. That ring is absolutely gorgeous. She's so dumb. That isn't a diamond. That's just a lollipop. You're just jealous of me, Susie. Emma, what do you think? Super. I've never seen anything like it. Oh, wow, and it smells so sweet. It really does look like a sucker. I told you. Look, Bella. What are you doing, Emma? Why are you licking my ring? Because it's tasty. We'll not have to throw it away because it's covered in your drool. Ugh. No, Bella. I thought we'd be together. You've broken my heart. Please don't go. Looks like everyone has problems in their love life. That's for sure. Hello, my love. I've finally found you. Go away. Don't you even touch me. Wow, I feel really bad for him. I wanted to give you this ring as a sign of my eternal love for you. And of course these flowers. But that's what? not a ring. You just smeared my finger with a felt-tip pen. And take away your stupid flowers. I'm sorry, but I really need help here. Can someone get him out of here? What about our love? I'm so over him. Hey ladies, which one of you is Emma? I came to see my princess right away. Oh, he must have made a mistake. I think he wanted to say Bella. No, no, I need Emma. Emma. There she is, my goddess. Me? Is this a joke? No way! I always knew I was gonna marry a prince one day. I have this diamond ring for you. Here, try it on now. Sure, I'm ready. Oh my gosh, look how it sparkles. Girls, take a look. This must be worth a fortune. There's clearly a mistake. This prince would never pick this filthy poor girl. Give me that ring. Um, you don't know what you're doing with things that expensive. Give it to me. Where'd my ring go? What a beautiful starry sky. I think we went a little overboard. Put the ring away. My ring! I thought I lost it forever. I need to put it on right away. Gosh, it's so pretty. Golden fountain? What could be more beautiful than this? Wow, that looks great! My chocolate fountain also looks really good. That's for sure. It's pretty hard to compete with that. Mine's so tiny. Yeah, and it's made of cardboard. I think I should start. What should I come up with? Oh, I know. I've been wanting a gold phone for a long time. It's time to make my dream come true. Wow, is that really gonna work? It better. Hey, look, it worked. Now I have a gold phone. Super. I'd really like to hold it in my hands at least once in my life. Gold's pretty good, but chocolate is much better. Because you can actually eat it. Mmm, so yummy. Wow, I want to try that too. Hey, what happened to my fountain? Congratulations, it's broken. I completely forgot that it's made of cardboard. I'll try to fix it. That's ridiculous. Just accept that you're not gonna get any chocolate. But I'll let you watch me eat. I have a better idea. If I use a straw, then I can eat the chocolate from Bella's fountain. There's nothing better than chocolate. Hey, where'd it go? Susie, did you do this? No, I have my own fountain. It must have been Emma. That's right! Her face is totally covered in chocolate! Don't be mad, Bella. I just really wanted something sweet. And there's no reason to eat somebody else's chocolate. I won't do it again. Or maybe I will. It was worth it. Great, I recorded it. Now I can post it online. You girls are so funny. Just hilarious.